Hi guys, welcome back, Scotty's Backyard Barbecue. Barbecue the way of life, folks, you know that? Got me a new shirt. See that? Feed me brisket and tell me I'm pretty. Yeah. Anyway, today on the Oklahoma Joe Tahoma 900, I've been running that pit through the paces ever since I got it. I run it every night after work. Chicken, pork chop, burger. I've been trying that out and it's been working amazing folks. So today I'm going to slap on two baby back ribs. One dry and one with barbecue sauce. Dry rub, barbecue sauce. I picked up two nice rack of ribs at my local butcher shop. They've been very good to me all year. So what Scotty is going to do for them, they don't know it yet. I'm going to cook these ribs and I'm going to bring them out to the butcher shop today for the boys to enjoy. All right. Of course, we got to sample one before we bring it out there, but we'll do that. Let's bring you back and I'll show you these red BB backs. All right, guys. In order to make this video short, I went ahead and seasoned this rack up with the Nashville Hot Barbecue. I got five bottles of this rub when I bought that Oklahoma Joe. And this one, I did with the Memphis-style barbecue rub. Tangy heat. And this is spicy heat. I put a toothpick in it so I know which one's which. And this one I'll probably put the sauce on. All right. Sauce will be determined later, so I haven't bought the sauce yet. All right. We'll see you outside, folks. All right, guys. Let's put these baby back ribs on. One on the back over here. And one on the front over here. Alright, the one in the back, remember, is a Nashville. We'll put that over here so we don't forget. And the one in the front is the Memphis. It's a little dark out here, folks, but you get the idea. Alright, let's go down here. We're on at 275. We're going to set this timer for three hours. We're not going to look at it, touch it, spritz it or anything for three hours. Pretty touchy dial though, folks. I like this little timer. And you press it and it's set three hours. Ah. We'll be back in three hours, folks. <laughs> All right, guys. We're about five minutes away from our three-hour mark. Let's open it up and give it a little spritz with this Oklahoma Joe water bottle. Oh, look at that, folks. They are looking amazing for three hours in. Got a nice bark setting on there. Nothing coming off on the finger. The old Oklahoma Joe bottle is adjustable. You get this off the Oklahoma Joe website. I got this off of the Amazon website. So far it's worked pretty good. Just got water in here, folks. A little steamer. So we will fine tune this a little bit. There we go. Ah. Let's get an internal temperature, folks. See where we're kind of at. Where we saw some. Oh, we're about... We're pretty close. We're two hours in at 275. We're just put some sauce on them, folks. Let me go get some of that sauce. All right, guys. There they are. This is the Nashville with the sauce. And this is the Memphis Barbecue Tangy Heat Dry Rub. So let's try the dry rub first, folks. That yeah, beautiful smoke ring, folks. Hard to get that out of the pellet grill, but this got good smoky wood flavor from that hickory. And that apple Kingsford. Let's try it. Oh yeah. That rub's pretty good, folks. Got a little heat to it, too. Mm-mm-mm. Got a nice bite, too. All right. This was the barbecue rub. I get that over there. This one's super tender, folks. Oh yeah. Mmm. 
can't beat that stubby sauce. I give it a light dusting when it come out of there. I'm sure digging that Oklahoma Tahoma 900, Oklahoma Joe 900. Good smoke flavor. Got a nice charcoal flavor, charcoal smoke flavor. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Beautiful smoke ring. I'm using this pit every day since I come home, folks. I can't stop eating these ribs. Hi, hey, folks. Oklahoma Joe, Tahoma 900, no joke. They turn out some amazing food. Some great barbecue out of my backyard. This will be the sixth day. I boxed it on Friday. Started cooking it on Saturday. Every day after work, I come home and we cook on it. I'll try to pop a piece of picture up. And, uh, hey, thanks for watching. These ribs are outstanding. I'm going to take these and drop them off at the local butcher shop for the boys. They don't know yet, but they're getting these back. All right, peace out, folks. And thanks for watching Scotty's Backyard Barbecue. Where barbecue can go your life, folks.